It's that time again, everybody. In fact, we're recording this right after episode number three. We're back with episode number four of a fascinating journey, or LD's fascinating journey, inside the mind of Period Flax. Period. Let's dive right into it. You're playing Mepo. Oh. This game, we just got done playing it. It was a learning experience. I think that's putting it rather gently. Wow. Gently? I, I don't know if that's putting it gently. I, that's, I mean, that's painful just to hear learning. The word learning <laughs> and me and Meepo. I learned nothing in this game. This was horrible. I, I, I didn't even want to play Meepo. People in the stream were like, Pure and Flash going to play Meepo because they just want to see me fall over and smash my face <laughs> on something. It's unpleasant. It's really unseemly, Pyrian. I gotta say. <laughs> unseemly. It's unseemly, sir. It is. <laughs> so I gotta, ugly. I gotta say, you're getting a pretty bad start to this game because it's already a minute in. You're still not even at the creep wave. Everyone else oh, has been farming. You, you also bought some rather unusual items. You're going yeah. for really early in a Basilius. Generally, you did random, I believe. So you have. No. Nope. Yeah, I think he did random. No, no, no. It, but was wasn't it all random? Yeah. Well, yeah, but you did random him. And I, but I swapped to Meepo. Oh, I, that's what it was. Cyborg Matt had Meepo, I think. And uh, you, I no, I had Gyrocopter. You had Shadow Shaman. Cyborg Matt had Meepo, and yeah. you wanted Gyrocopter, so I was going to swap with you. And then Matt said he didn't want to play Meepo, so I took Meepo. So I took one for the team. I just want that pointed out. All right. Well, I gotta say, for a, a guy who's never played Meepo before, we just, just made this game as miserable for you as humanly possible. <laughs> you're you're soloing the suicide lane, which has gotten that name for very good reason, and you're doing it as Meepo. You have no idea what to do with this hero, and you're up against a dual lane with the ogre oh. and the weaver and a roaming axe, Illusion. who spends like this entire game just living my lane. I was absolutely just so frustrated because. <laughs> First Axe comes mid, then Ogre comes mid. It was just like a parade of heroes into my lane. So you get a little space to move, uh, but not that much. And even Weaver 1v1 is pretty tough. I, I hate Weaver. Like, Weaver's one of those heroes, if you're laning against him early, especially solo, as fucking Meepo or someone, <laughs> there's no... What, what can you do? I love... Wait, 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 wait. I love the, like, absolute... Dis like, the sheer contempt and disgust you already have for this hero. Oh. <laughs> He's you think horrible. he's like shit on your shoe or something? He's ugh. <laughs> I mean, he does so little damage with his fucking shitty shovel. Look at this is me, by the way. When you see me frozen and nothing's happening, that's because I'm cursing everybody's name on, on 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 the chat, and I'm just I'm just so angry that I had to play this fucking guy. And he's he like his shovel does the he has to have the least auto attack damage of any hero in the game at the start. I just can't believe you're meant to get a last hit with him. So you do nothing. You surely do nothing until you get two meepos. Yeah. Uh, well, his auto attack damage is kind of low, but that's because he has Geo Strike, which is his third ability. Uh, it does some damage and it slows. Uh, and every Meepo has the like. So when you have more than one Meepo, when you get his ultimate, they yeah. all get the Geo Strike ability. So the damage amps up, and it's like it's it's designed to try and balance him because otherwise, if he if he was if his base damage is higher, then all the Meepos are gonna hit harder. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what is that? Oh, that was a pretty good net. All right, before we get too far into this, I have to say your skill build. No good. Not recommended. Uh, no good, really? No That's good. Just, I thought I'd cracked it. You want to max. You want to max poof by level seven because poof is your big. Uh, it's a big AOE nuke, and all the meepos get it. This is how you do damage. Uh, once okay, you get level wait, six. Wait, 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 wait. So what's the point in leveling it when I have no other meepos? Because you, when you hit six, then you have another. But if you haven't leveled it, then it's not good. Then you have to wait until like level ten before you can use it. Oh, I see. So it's a preemptive thing. Think of it. Think of it like bringing protection with you in hopes that you might meet a lovely lady when you're out on the town, and uh, that that looked like it should have hit. Uh, you know, so that you're prepared. You know, you want to be prepared for what's to uh, come. I'm I'm always prepared for meeting a lovely lady. It's I mean, other than like I met Mrs. Flax a long Mrs. time. Mrs. Flax, ago. Mrs. Flax is sleeping, right? So you, you're you. She is asleep. Yeah. You wouldn't say this in front of her. No, but she watches all my videos. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Mrs. Flex. But just to make sure, I haven't mentioned anything about any other ladies, I'm sure. But Yeah. Well, there you go. The jig is up here, and now you're ah, in a little bit of run, trouble. Meepo! <laughs> he does look kind of pathetic, I gotta say. Oh, I love so... his, talk, like, his voice. The voice acting for Meepo is really funny, because he sounds like a cabbie. 
You know what I mean? Like a new York cabbie, he's like, oh, I can't do it. Oh god. How did you let? How did you let this happen? Twenty-three, dude. What am I doing? Run. <laughs> Who am I gonna teleport to there? <laughs> I like how instead of trying to net someone, you tried to t poof on top of yourself. Like that's gonna save you. Which does like twenty damage of that, eighty damage. Oh my. done. Woohoo! If you if you hit someone, which is <laughs> oh man, uh, like, I, I having just played this game, I can remember a lot about it and. I mean, there's a world of pain for anybody who's a good Meepo player watching me play Meepo in this game. It, it's going to be painful. But there are a couple of moments later on where I actually use the tab key, which is just located to the left of the Q key, as I've discovered. And you can tab between the Meepos and you can do tap poof, tap poof, tap poof. And you can do like multiple poofs on top of one another and you do a buttload of damage. I do that a few times. Yeah, that's where he gets his strength from. You, you Basically what you do is you just hang on until you get level 6, you max out Poof, you get 1 point in Net and 1 point in, net and one point in Geo Strike, uh, and then you go back and you max, max the Net after that, because uh, the nukes, you, you really do want to max the two active abilities first. Uh, but yeah, you get to level 6, and then you can, usu you can usually find a solo kill. Meepo can pretty much solo any hero at level 6. Uh, in a one v one, because there's there's two of them, man, and it might be a, it might be a shitty little shovel to you, but if there's Shadow Shaman is is terrible. Just let me call that right now. He he can do the cool ward trap, but other than that, he sucks almost as hard as I do. Just saying that, calling Matt out on sucking his Shadow Shaman. <laughs> the last time that we cast a game where Matt was in it, you flamed him as well. So this is now two for two. <laughs> His He's art... a northerner and a southerner. I'm a so you know that's it. It's gonna happen. I have to do it. It's gonna it's gonna it's gonna be done. Look at him creep fucking kill stealing from me right there. I was gonna kill that creep. He saw me going in with the shovel, and he was like, nope. <laughs> no, I think I think that was you being like nope because you hit it at the wrong time. Matt leaves the lane. You have the creep to yourself. You miss the one, and now the other's getting denied. I don't do, blame him. Do Fifty three damage at level four as Meepo auto attack. 47 is what I'm seeing. I see 47 plus 6. Uh, maybe my dote is bugged, because I don't nope. see the plus 6. Because Weaver does 80, Matt does 61, so I'm doing fuck all! How much does Gyrocopter do? 69. I do the least on the entire team. Anti-Mage, 70. Windrunner does 107! Speaking of Gyrocopter, I'm actually going to follow myself here, because this turns into just like the most ridiculous little chase. I'm going to live with like 5 health. And here comes X, my best friend. This guy has just been living mid. I am so mad right now. The stream is flaming me. The other team is laughing at me. And Ursa's wow. farming his you had, Midas. You had like 19 health at one point. Though. That's me the entire... Like, we could do a second video on me playing this game. <laughs> and you could just laugh at me, like, running for my life and just getting destroyed mid all game long. Wow. But, uh... Well, well, the end, I'm fairly confident of insane. I went I went for a Dagon 5 Ethereal Blade at the end of the game, so I, that's how I caught up in terms of kills. But we're going to go back to you now, because here comes that horrible Shadow Shaman of Cyborg Mats, and he's getting caught out. But look, did you notice that Matt turned him into a chicken, and I threw a net at him, just so we could both run away. Like, we're not going to kill anything, we're just running away. And then in comes LD, gyrocopters him. He's my favorite hero, man. Oh, kill! I remember this. Now you were like, period. I, I was yelling at you, cause like <laughs> normally I don't mind too much, but I was having such a bad time mid. Axe ganked me there. Ogre ganked me there. That's why I came top. I was just like, I do this a lot when I'm solo mid. If they're like three or four manning me mid, I'm just like, okay, fuck this lane. I'm going to gank the other lanes. And then especially if it's a guy who's been harassing me, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna kill you now, Wait. mister. Uh, do, do, but do you know what? That goes back to what you said in the last video when you said that, or we we came to an agreement that good players have a go at the bad players on the team when they're having a shitty time. So you, things weren't going great for you mid, and you were like, period! Whereas normally, you wouldn't give a shit if I steal a kill, because like in the game we played where you were tiny, you would have had 10 kills by now. So you'd be like, ah, oh, take it, little man. <laughs> Whereas now, you're like furious that I've stolen your chance of a kill. <laughs> but I still would have stolen it in both circumstances, because fuck you. That's... <laughs> Such a team player. That's completely true. Something I missed when the game was actually happening is apparently Axe died to the neutrals. <laughs> oh, did he? Yeah. <laughs> I bet that guy was glad that nobody said anything. The, sh the shame of 500 people laughing at you. 
He just said, a new age has dawned because I got a kill as well. But perhaps the worst thing for him is that we missed it on the live stream, but we're catching it on the VOD, because the VOD's <laughs> gonna get a lot more views than the live stream did. Yeah, owned. And this one's gonna go on your channel too, so... Yeah, that's It's gonna right. get even it's more, even more views. Flags' channel. Shame you on know? you, Moonies. Shame on you. <laughs> oh man, if your shame is projected on... Like, if people are watching a, a video on my channel, and being ashamed for someone other than me, you just got owned. You've dodged a bullet. Oh, yeah. and this is where you're like... <laughs> you asked, you, I think you. I don't know if you were trolling or did you actually legitimately not know how the hero worked? Because you were surprised that there were two Meepos. Everyone had said to me, "Oh man, P Black, I can't wait to see you play Meepos." Genuinely, Meepo or whatever Meepos. Uh, genuinely, like every like once a Meepo was announced as being the probably the next hero and everything, I genuinely had a ludicrous number of people telling me they couldn't wait to see me play Meepo, and I thought, okay, so he's probably going to be like Chen or someone like that, because everybody knows I can't micro um, <laughs> micro at all. Like, I just can't do it. But handling one hero is enough trouble. So once I realized what Meepo was probably micro, but I didn't realize he was like a permanent another Meepo. I had no idea that that meant I just, now, now that's it, you got a bunch of Meepos. And I struggled to understand that for the duration of the game, I would say. Uh, yeah, we're seeing, you, you talked about the issues with Micro, you were trying to move one back and click on the other, but yeah. you, you accidentally misclicked there, you didn't select the second Meepo. Uh, and it's, it's hard to click on a thing. It you is. Know, it is hard. Like, I'm tempted, next time I play Meepo, I'll play Zoomed In. So I actually, I don't know if you know, but in the top left corner when you're playing a hero like Meepo, you get a little icon for each one. You might want to that's try using that. Way. That's a long way to move the mouse. I've got a, I've got a big monitor. Like, if I'm moving the mouse all the way over there... Yeah, like I hear you. ...minute of my time. A minute? Oh, man. You got other pr you got other problems besides Meepo, then, I gotta say. <laughs> and now, I think I teleport, and I can't believe that the other Meepo doesn't come with me. I'm oh, like, yeah. what? Yeah, yeah, own. yeah. You're like, where the fuck is he? <laughs> where the fuck is? <laughs> and the best part is, I think he start like he starts walking bottom, and then you're like, well, I guess I guess he's not coming top. He's just gonna have to walk it, and people are like, wait, you have a skill? Because I'm like, oh, really? Dyer's I can just teleport, and you use it, and it's. Yes. <laughs> I gotta say, the effects a little under in Dota One. It's much more like impactful when he poofs in. That was just like a plink. Well, yeah, because it's Meepo. I mean, it shouldn't be, like, some big dramatic... <laughs> this is the thing, like, when I see him... Like, I, we played another game, This obviously the one that we aren't doing a bit about, where I played Lena, and I owned. I'm going to call it right now, I owned as Lena. But, I mean, it was an all-random, all all-random, all-mid. I did pretty fucking well. I'm pretty pleased with myself for playing Lena that well. Oh, yeah, and that game was good. I, I killed a bunch of stuff, right? Her spell effects should be big and dramatic, fire shooting out of her ass and everything like that. <laughs> I don't want a dramatic spell effect for Meepo, it should be bullshit. It should be like a little, eh, like an apology of an effect. Oh god. It's alright, I'm gonna get out of there. Watch this! You Come used it! You used it! And then you just showed up mid, I was like, why is Pyrian mid? And why is he dying to battle hunger? <laughs> Oh, I like how you tranquil boots the the Meepo that was already full health, but not the I, one that. I honestly, I didn't. I just thought if I used Radiant's something on one Meepo, it worked on all of them. Fallen. Genuinely, that would be actually that would be pretty interesting if it worked that way. It's sort of like Wisp, I guess. But nah, that's not how it works. <laughs> Luckily, I've got this fucking shovel. If, okay, See, if they not... if they made the shovel like five times as big, would you like Meepo then? Would that be enough for you to quit your bitching? If, if there was a Meepo cosmetic item that meant his shovel was like a snow shovel. No, like would... even no, think bigger. Like just imagine it's like one of those. Oh god, what like caterpillar like excavation? Like, like a digger, like an excavator. <laughs> yeah. Like yeah. it's just this little dude sitting on an excavator. <laughs> <laughs> I would love Meepo. That should be a cus like and that they'll never do that in Dota. But that, that's something they would do in Heroes of New Earth. They just have like these total replacement models where like it's just yeah. it doesn't even look like the hero, which is really hard to play. Because then you have to memorize all the custom models as well as all the God, heroes. Do you know, I, this was funny, there was a there was a thread on a forum about this and uh, people bitching about cosmetics and stuff and how it ruins the game. I, I genuinely I'm glad I want the spell effects to stay the same. Because it, it's enough to remember all those spell effects. You've got how many heroes? 60, 70 heroes when the game's done, or maybe even more. And, like, they've all got three or four spells. That's a lot of spell effects to memorize. If people can have custom spell effects, 
that's that's too much. That's too fucking much, I think. So I think it's fair that you stop at spell effects. Custom JCB model for Meepo. I mean, you know, where does it end? Genuinely, you'd, you'd have all kinds of ridiculous stuff running around. Can I just can I just interrupt your your train of thought and? What are you doing with this? This Meepo has just been sitting in this camp, blocking the camp from spawning, not farming. I will tell you exactly what that Meepo is doing, sir. <laughs> okay? Because I remember, because this game was recent enough. Someone said to me, Pyrian, just get that Meepo, right click on Ursa, follow him around, and leech XP. I was like, okay, I did that. I right clicked on Ursa. Ursa must have I, done some clever shit. I think you misclicked. I no, because otherwise I wouldn't have been there. Otherwise I wouldn't have been in that camp. I was clearly with Ursa for something. He must have gone around a tree and I lost sight of him or something. I think you can't lose sight of him because he's on your team. You share the same vision. <laughs> oh, I don't fucking know then. So, I, <laughs> someone would have to watch the fucking replay. I don't give a uh, shit. Wait, someone would have to watch the replay. Hmm, I thought that's what we were doing. But, but not, uh... not... Oh, fuck you. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, man. <laughs> I don't know. I, I thought I clicked on Ursa. It's conceivable that I misclicked. I can't really imagine that I would. Yeah. Here's me coming in. Look at this. I should have stayed. My first instinct was to go top through the river and wait by the stairs for them to come that way. If I'd done that, we would have had an easy kill. Oh, that bastard. He's just so slippery. I know. Look at that. Fucking Uncle Johnny. The, like, we played this guy in the... <laughs> <laughs> we played him in the previous game, and he was Doom, and we were doing 5v5 all mid while we were streaming. And he just kept on dooming me, no matter what the situation yep. was. He'd doom me with, yeah, like, 5 yeah. health, he'd doom me, like, when I had full health. Like, nice. either way, you don't need to. And I don't know why the hell you went in here, but this was some- Meepo! Send in Meepo! <laughs> <laughs> and that seemed like a good idea when there's a bunch of you. Right? Yeah. Like, there's, there's two or three of us. Brilliant. Oh god. <laughs> Oh, this is it. This is that one Meepo dies at the tower, and this is where you start bitching about. <laughs> I had one at the base. Like, my, in my mind, you have three Meepos or whatever out fighting. You have one Meepo at the base. Indestructible. Like, the, he, they can kill the other two. You've got a spare Meepo. Turns out, which no one told me until the game had begun, that if one of the Meepos dies, you all die. It's like the opposite of the Brewmaster role. So I'm kind of confused about why it's a good thing. It's like all of a sudden Meepo's like Brewmaster ult is like great. Now it's really hard to kill me. Meepo ult, mo mo Meepo's more pro mo problems. I'm gonna call that right now. <laughs> I, I would say that that last Meepo gank there was pretty much the yardstick for Meepo play. Like oh, okay. it, it, most most Meepo players would look at that and say this is standard Meepo play. Yeah, even this, a... need, this needs to be addressed in Meepo's favor. It's clearly unfair. Even like pace setting Meepo play. I mean, let's let's not be modest. Period. You know, <laughs> you're not any old schmuck. Just you know, with, I'm not just some idiot. With a couple of Dota. couple I'm, of I'm... dinky shovels here. I mean, <laughs> you're, you're coming in on the caterpillar, buddy. You got some exactly. big construction equipment. I'm rolling in <laughs> on the fucking mega digger, like something you'd see on MythBusters. You know? <laughs> That's, I really, I really wish that there was some way we could have a model replacement only for you. Like you're the only person in the world of Dota that's allowed to have uh, it. Uh, or you, I, I your Meepos just get <laughs> to roll around on construction. <laughs> <laughs> uh, can you imagine? The thing is, I would never ever play Meepo again if you paid me. So it'd be a complete waste of a of a model. <laughs> All right, we are back in business, period. So I think we were just talking about how you would never actually play this hero again. This is going to be your first and last game's Meepo. I gotta say, man, it's a crying shame, because I really see some potential in your play here. Dyer's Fuck off. Bottom tower has fallen. You don't see it. There's no potential here. What potential? <laughs> this is, I'm awful. I mean, this is just... Like, most heroes that I play, I've got, like, you press a button, there's a, there's an ability that you use on a person, you do damage Dyer's to that person. Like, Meepo, you've attack. got you've got the net, Dyer's but unless you're, like, right the around them... With, with good items and stuff, you're doing nothing. So, given that I'm terrible at farming, I can't multitask, I can't micromanage units at all, I, I just don't see why I would ever want to play Meepo again. Like, some heroes I think, like Anti-Mage, I might be a bad Anti-Mage or a bad Nature's Prophet, but I can see a way out of it, you know, it's like, okay, I can sort of see how eventually I would figure it out, but with this guy, 
it's gonna be years before I get ever play Meepo. Years, literally years. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe if you played like 300 Meepo games in a row. Oh god, this is not wait, looking wait, good. Wait, 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 multi poof. No, dead. Uh oh, here comes Ursa. By the way, I just gotta say, this Ursa's item build, this is the worst Ursa item build I have ever seen. <laughs> he rushed up, he, he went for a Vlad, so that's fine. Juggle Ursa, then he, he goes back for a Midas at 14 minutes. Ursa doesn't need to farm. Ursa already, he doesn't need many items. That's the beauty of the hero. Like, he's already a fantastic hero with just a yeah. Vlad's a phase. But he goes back for the Midas, he just farms all game, and it's not any game where he's doing a period. We've already got a Meepo, a Gyrocopter, and an Anti-Mage. Like, we don't need <laughs> another farmer. We've oh, got man. that locked up. I was I was furious. I, I Not really. I mean, you know, no, no, ton-in-cheek no. angry. But The thing is, like, if you look at Ursa in most puppy games, he should be ripping the fuck out of Windrunner. Ancient Apparition should just die in, like, a second to Ursa. Axe should be in big trouble, really. And maybe even Ogre Maga. Like, when I watch... Like, Weaver can just fucking do his invisible bullshit and run away. But, yeah, you're right. Like, Ursa normally should be ripping shit up with his claws. Just with his bare hands. It's like, he doesn't... He, you know, he doesn't need, like, a fancy cape. Like, he's already got he the big no bad claws. Cape. Ursa ain't wearing no fancy cape. He doesn't even need clothes. He's a fucking bear. What is with all these pauses? That's you pausing there. What are you pausing for? Uh, I think this one is quick. I'm just pausing to piss you off, since apparently uh, we're... I'm getting pissed off on the replay, so that's probably right. <laughs> if I recall correctly, this game we were both just saying fuck you to each other. <laughs> <laughs> that sounds like it. Yeah, sounds about right. And here you go. Here I go, dead. Still struggling to understand. You're... <laughs> oh, die. You're not, you're not yeah. learning. You're not no. learning at all this game. Well, actually, what you're witnessing here is p Flack learning. Like, this, this is how I learn. It takes a long time, hell of a long time, but gradually, shit is sinking in. Like, gradually, very gradually, I'm figuring stuff out. I'm like, oh, okay. And honestly, by the end of this game, you will see me doing something that most Meepo players would be like, that's that's reasonable standard Meepo play. I guarantee it. I'll point it out when it happens because you might miss it. But trust me, there is some Meepo play here. I will take your word for it. Because right, right now, man, right now, man, I'm not seeing it. I'm not you seeing do, it. You take my word and you shove it. <laughs> All right. So you respawn. I, I feel like right now you're a lemming. Like you just, you know, like <laughs> like all the, the here's the thing. I've always been trying to like. <laughs> lemmings, there's no, there's no communication with the lemmings, right? So like, the way, like, the, the like they just see one disappear off a cliff, and they're like, hmm, maybe I should run off that cliff. Maybe that, that would... like, fun. Yeah, and like, next thing you know, like the entire fucking colony's dead. Like, or our couriers died because I selected it when I was selecting all my meepos in the fountain. <laughs> and you just group, group, <laughs> move them. Oh, that net just missed. That was a good net. I thought so. I just killed Ogre Magi. <laughs> wow. Did you just really try to net a catapult? Yeah. You definitely... <laughs> <laughs> no. I, I'll tell you what this is about. Someone told... I think Cyborg Matt said to me, Here, Pyrian, you can fucking... He's not a scouser. He's from Manchester. You can... I can let me do a mag action. All right, mate. You can fucking net invisible units and that. Oh, go on. You can fucking net Weaver when he's invisible. So I'm like chucking nets around trying to catch invisible stuff. He owns in every way. Oh, no. With, oh, no. Oh, no. Tell me you tell me you don't leave base without the mechanism. Okay. Go get it. Go get it. There we go. I like how you just... <laughs> I just love how every game, there's always this point where there's a huge team fight. Like, most players would be frantically trying to get out there to help the team. You're just like, eh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna dick around at base for a little bit. Honestly, my, my, like... I've earned a vacation right now. Yeah. I just died. Like, you know, what more can you do for, for someone? I died for you. You know what I mean? <laughs> you, you, know, you cut me some fucking slack. <laughs> That's that is the most brilliant line I think I've ever heard you utter. I am gonna, I am gonna use that one. Like whenever I'm feeding from now on, I'm just, I died for you. I died for you. <laughs> oh man. Oh. Send, send in one meepo because that's how it works. You send one in, 
and then Perian Flats can definitely do the. Watch this. Pew 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 pew. Watch this. Oh Look god. Oh, you're 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 very dead. No, I'm fine. Because one of us will get away. That's how it works. I... No, period. That's not how it works. You fucking idiot. Switching between mentalities, it takes it takes a long time. Like you know, the, if you can imagine like a really old school projector where the slide changes, like there's like a whirring sound, like brrrr, it's like clunk clunk, -clunk, -clunk, -clunk. like clunk 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 clunk. That's the slide changing. That's my brain changing between heroes. It's like this loud mechanical clanking clunking sound. So when I'm I, I'm playing Sand King one game. And the next game, I'm playing a completely different kind of character or hero. It just, it, I just, it takes me such a long time to get into the right mindset. That's pretty much what you, what you're seeing here. <laughs> and I mean, look at oh that my god! <laughs> Windrunner's like saw me coming, queued up her ult, just whittled me down. She didn't even need to do that. That was, that was. Okay. Uh... <laughs> I really want to, like, this is where I want instant replay. I want to say, like, show me that kill again. Because that was painful to watch. Like, Look, I mean, this, did you this, see this... Shadow just getting taken out by Ancient Apparition? That was pretty sweet, too. Yeah, that was, I actually got Cyborg Matt killed there. Because we could have gotten this kill sooner. Uh, it's, it's a long story, it's not worth explaining. But I got him killed there, so I <laughs> take full responsibility for that one. I love the sound of the rocket. I still love the sound of the rocket. Gyrocopter is personal. <laughs> He's my personal favorite hero. I was Why messing around like a lot. Him so much? Uh, just because, I don't know, the whole, like, the whole vibe about him and, like, all the sound effects. I love the voice work. Just, so much, he does, well, just, like, I love missiles. I love, you know, all sorts of high-tech stuff like that. Like, you just, love missiles? He appeals to me. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 don't know, I love, I love war games. Like, I've always been a big fan of them growing up. Like, I play okay. a lot of, like, strategy board games and, like, I, oh, I love... Really? I love, com well, not so much anymore, but I love Command of Conquer, uh, like what? Red Alert, like games like that. They, I did always play, enjoyed those. Did you ever play Axes and Allies? Yeah, yeah, I actually, I have yeah, that, I and I play so it. so much of that game. I haven't played it in a long time, but I love that game. They've changed it, like, I used to play it a lot back in the, I guess the early 90s, like when it was originally coming out, I guess, 80s and 90s, with, with a very good friend of mine, we used to play it a lot. And uh, with a whole bunch of us, we'd all play it. And subsequently, I've discovered that there are, like, multiple revisions of it. New units, there's, like, all kinds, of, you know, there's just a Europe version, there's just a Pacific version. Like, if you don't play a lot of board games, and now I just play computer games, you come back and revisit board games, and you're like, wow, there's all kinds of really, really cool board games, but... Who the fuck has friends around to play board games anymore? Now I just get online and play games on the internet. It's kind of sad. <laughs> it's, it's sad, but it's also, it's just so impractical. It's, like... too, it's too convenient. I can meet up with people on the internet in two seconds and send my mate a message. Hey, you there in Florida or California or whatever, you want to play? Yeah, cool. Whereas my friends, I'm like, what are you guys doing next weekend? And now at this point, my mind has been blown because there's now four Meepos. And I think at this point, I just completely melt down. We'll see. We'll see. I start. I start meepoing all over the place. You're farming, man. You got. You got a lot of bracers. You know. Yeah. I got the bracers because I kept fucking dying. Like if I'm dying a lot, you'll see me. But just I'm just like fuck it. I'm buying a bracer. Like that's gonna solve everything. <laughs> look at this. Look at this. Now look, watch this. Watch this. I'm here comes X. Here comes X. Watch this. I think I do pretty well here against X. Net. Net. Meepo. Hit it with the poof. Pretty well. Oh no. What the fuck? Like I know I'm gonna die here to to the to the, the, the spinning shit, but honestly, given that I thought I was a dead man, like an absolute dead man, he's level nineteen, he's got like a heaven's halberd and he's got his blink and all this kind of shit and a vanguard. I got him down to half health without knowing what the fuck I was doing. I was actually quite pleased with myself there. Netted him from multiple angles. He didn't know whether he was coming or going, there were dudes boofing all over him. So you fed the axe and that's a victory. That's what I'm hearing here. Flax victory, yeah. <laughs> I got like a kill streak first time I'd ever played Lena. Because essentially you just mash all your power buttons and that's it. You're hitting like, you've got so much AoE, you've got a stun, you've got, I mean, her ult is fucking ridiculous. That's the kind of thing I need. You press a button, you click a man, <laughs> they die. Like, that's it. Press, press button, click, click target, target dies. That's a spell. Meepo is like, 
passives and bunches of meepos. You got to press the tab key and netting and micromanaging and fuck me. That's no fun. He's not a fun hero to play. Fuck that. I want fire. Like you said it yourself. His poof is this apology of an effect. Poof. Oh, here are, here comes Meepo. Poof. Yeah, Where's the fun in that? That's rather disappointing. I got to say. Gouts of flame shoot out of my neck. Like boom. Lena rolls around tits first, fire shooting out of her nipples, owning everything. <laughs> oh man, <laughs> shooting shit out of her nipples. That is a that is a rather disturbing image. I gotta say. <laughs> how did, how would that even look? Like how does shit come out of a nipple? Like that's. No 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 no. The, she's shooting fire out of her nipples. No, but you said shit, so I'm rolling with it. Did I? You said shooting shit. I, I know what you meant. I know what you meant. I'm just choosing to ignore that. Just th th there's a lot of there's a lot of pictures on the internet of of <laughs> nipples with shit coming out of them. I guess. <laughs> Are there? I wouldn't know. <laughs> oh, go on. Did you see how quickly I tabbed between meepos then? And I owned Windrunner as a result. Oh, yeah. And she said, "Stop it with that." <laughs> Never. I think she, I think she was mad because uh, she she ate all the nets. She yeah. doesn't want to, you know. She doesn't like to be held down. She's a she's a foxy redhead. Say what you will about her. She's not maybe not the most exciting or crazy or quirky hero. She may not be as huggable and lovable as Pudge. She may not be as uh, scary and badass looking as Sand King. But Windrunner's got her. Oh, I love Windrunner. She's got her ginger charms. I I love Windrunner. I've been playing. I've actually been playing a shitload of Win Windrunner prior to this. And uh, I was I was thinking of doing a bit of Windrunner because honestly I she's a great hero to play. And if you look at um what is it buff Dota or Dota buff or whatever, if you look at all the pro matches, she is the winningest hero in pro matches. Did you know that LD? Uh, I'm pretty sure you're wrong about that. No, 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 I'm absolutely right. Someone linked all the pro matches. Like there was like 800 and something pro matches 860 pro matches they linked and windrunner comes out on top in terms of win rate and percentage windrunner's on top you find the stats sir we, we can post them Let's, if you like i'm Guaranteed. gonna i'm gonna pull bruno in here as soon as we're done recording this one and <laughs> we'll we'll get some confirmation from the, the man himself okay i'm honestly if you're gonna trust in, if you're gonna trust anybody on an opinion about those two is it gonna be me or is it gonna be bruno be honest can i choose not you is that an option that's yeah. a very, very good option. Well not, done. Not you just, not P flags. Wisely, it's like the end of Last Crusade when Indiana Jones drinks from the right cup. I'm like the old dude who's like, "You have chosen wisely." See, I I can I I could not remember like I, I don't know if I can remember a single movie line like a single <laughs> reference of any kind. Like I'm the exact opposite of you. I remember like all those little things that I've done, like details about my life, like games I played in Dota. You know, dates I've went on and all the idiotic mistakes I've made. Like, oh man, here like, we go. <laughs> like, see, see, yeah, <laughs> I cannot, I could not remember a movie line for to save uh, my fucking life. I am so jealous of your ability to do that. You, gotta, you're, gotta be being honest. Able to remember movie lines is way better than being able to remember real life. Or it, it, it is. Real life sucks, man. That's why we play video games. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm I'm sort of kidding, but there, there's there's a grain of truth to it. There's a grain of truth. The world is a cold and lonely place. Wow, on that bombshell. And then you die, and yeah, I guess that does it. But first, let's fiddle out a fucking Dota two into the equation. P flex, we did it. Our first time doing two vids in one day. Back to back, dude. Well, it's good. It's good because we won't be recording for a while. But, no, that's uh, I, I like I would sooner we find an evening when we can both do it and just fucking hammer them out because honestly I, tonight was great I, like I thoroughly enjoyed it we played Dota all fucking evening we made two vids awesome 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 